The paintings of Rousseau are well known for their vivid colors, minimalistic composition, and exotic subject matters. His paintings frequently featured imaginary jungles, animals, and characters from non-Western societies. The works of the Fauves, the Symbolists, and the Nabis had a significant impact on his artwork. If you have enjoyed the video so far, we would really appreciate it if you would subscribe to our channel. Let's know if you want more videos like this, by hitting the like button, now back to the video. Let's examine some of his top 5 best works. 1. The Dream by Henri Rousseau. The dream depicts a young woman with a couple of lions near her. The jungle area is illuminated by a full moon. This painting is a classic example of Rousseau's symbolic style, and it has become one of his most recognizable and well-known works. The lion is frequently used as a metaphor for power and bravery due to its reputation for imposing dominance. On the other hand, the naked woman represents purity and defenselessness. The two figures together symbolize the significance of the dream and the concept of the subconscious. Rousseau's use of gentle brushwork and warm hues in this artwork furthers the impression of calm and relaxation that the scene evokes. The composition of the work is quite balanced and harmonious, with the woman and the lion in the foreground and the desert scenery in the backdrop. Many believe that the work symbolizes the creative potential of the mind's unconscious. The lion represents the more primitive and untamed sides of humanity, while the woman represents the dreamer in her reflective condition. The forest's lush, emerald background is often seen as a metaphor for nature and the bond between humans and the natural world. The painting's dynamism and motion are enhanced by the use of bright, primary colors and heavy, impasto brushstrokes. The surreal and fantastical qualities of the painting are heightened by this and the dreamlike environment. In conclusion, the Dream is an oil painting that shows a woman and a lion in a woodland environment. It's interpreted as a symbol of the subconscious mind and the power of imagination. 2. Tiger in a Tropical Storm by Henri Rousseau. There is lightning in the background of the artwork, as well as a tiger. The tiger's head is cocked to the side as if it were caught off guard by the sudden storm. The unpredictable and uncontrollable aspect of life and nature is depicted in the painting. The tiger, typically depicted as a powerful and majestic animal, is represented here to be defenseless and at the mercy of the weather. With flashes of lightning and turbulent clouds, a storm represents the unexpected and dramatic shifts that can occur in one's life. A sensation of motion and energy is conveyed by the use of bright, contrasting colors and thick, impasto brushstrokes in this painting. Like the dramatic scenario itself, this adds a sense of motion and tension to the painting. 3. The Sleeping Gypsy by Henri Rousseau. Henri Rousseau depicts a wanderer who has fallen asleep in the Sleeping Gypsy. Among the desert sands, the artwork depicts a woman dozing off in an exotic, brightly colored gown. A lion, who is also at rest, is laying next to her, while the background is adorned with a crescent moon and stars. The painting is often interpreted as symbolizing the noble savage concept. The painting depicts a surreal scene in which a domesticated human and a wild animal live together in peace. The woman's apparent lack of fear and calmness in the presence of the lion is indicative of her affinity with the natural world and its inhabitants. The lion, for its part, appears to be guarding her, and is often seen to represent the idea of nature's ferocity and might be tamed by the woman's presence. A bright, almost ethereal blue is used to paint the background. Together with the surreal setting, this emphasizes the fantastical nature of the artwork. 4. The Snake Charmer by Henri Rousseau. The Snake Charmer is a painting of a woman in a tropical jungle scene, playing a flute while surrounded by snakes. People interpret the artwork as a metaphor for man's power to tame and subdue nature. Because of her skill with the flute, the snakes are completely submissive to the Snake Charmer. It's also possible to read it as a metaphor for the ability of art and music to help people rise above and get past their difficulties. The snake charmer may stand for humankind's ability to comprehend and manage nature, while the lush, tropical surroundings may represent the wild and untamed sides of nature. The background is filled with rich vegetation, just like the artist's other works of jungle scenes. The snake charmer is surrounded by several wild animals, all of whom are attracted to her because of her music. 5. Boy on the Rocks by Henri Rousseau. Boy on the Rocks was painted between 1895 and 1897. The only character in the work is the kid himself. The boy is dressed in a black sweater, cloak, white pants with black stripes, and an undershirt in a similar color. 
The outfit is completed with a pair of black boots. His lips are completely closed, yet he has a tiny smile on his face. The boy's face appears flushed against the white background because of the redness of his cheeks. It is impossible to discern where the youngster stands in relation to the huge rocks in the artwork because he is the same size as them. He appears to have been inserted digitally, with the addition of a small amount of shadow to amuse onlookers. A flat veil of the sky hangs directly behind the boy and the water is a grey-blue rim that delineates the sky from the earth below.